Paying viewer, welcome to our first act viewers breaking news. Yes, after staying in the moderate category for nearly a fortnight, Delhi's air quality is likely to deteriorate to the poor category by the weekend and trigger stage one of the graded response action plan, officials say. Measures under the revised GRAB, which is implemented every year in phases from October 1, did not come into effect in the national capital region yet, as the least air quality index remained below the threshold of 201. Stage 1 comprises 27 measures, including shutting down construction and demolition sites over 500 square kilometers but are not registered with the government on its web portal for dust management and periodic mechanized sweeping and water sprinkling on roads. The least 24 hours average AQI was recorded at 177 moderate on Thursday, though the AQI has gone up by only one unit by compared to Wednesday's reading of 176 moderate. There has been a gradual deterioration over the last few days as the temperature began to drop and the number of farm fires started increasing across the northern plains. Dallas AQI on Tuesday was 155 and 146 on last Monday. Like last year, the Commission for Air Quality Management, which enforces GRAF, said it will rely on the early warning systems for Delhi to take preemptive actions. However, a CAQM official said even though they take preemptive actions based on EWS forecast for stages 2, 3, 4, they have to wait for the AQI to cross 200 and touch the 4 category to enforce stage 1 measures. EWS forecast shows the AQI is likely to be moderate on Friday before touching poor on Saturday. Based on the AQI on Saturday, measures under stage 1 could be enforced. The CAQM subcommittee on GRAB will hold regular meetings based on forecast, a CAQM official said. Experts said a drop in mercury which slows down dispersion of pollutants combined with a rise in from fires has started to impact AQI. This makes it difficult for pollutants to displace. The northwesterly winds are bringing pollutants and rally, said Dipankar Saha, former head of CPCBSER laboratory. BNDAS report, Post TV.